How your business started? Yeah, I've got it. Especially like for young kids, because you started as a small person yeah, who was yeah, interested in business. Yeah, yeah, I was born into business back home yeah, in my yeah. country in Nigeria. Yeah. My both parents are traders. I work with them, finish primary school, go to shop, secondary school, go to shop, weekend, put things in the van go all over the area, sell out the goods to people. Yeah. It's part of me. It's not something that I just start middle of the night that yeah, I want to start business. Mm. I was brought into it and I realized that I think it's the knowledge that I got. I can develop it. When I was in Nigeria, I have my own shop, mm -hmm. small shop, before I make up my mind that no, I want to come to abroad. Here we are. I have my own shop also in London and that's it. Okay. Maybe three or four principles of starting a business. We did mention about having funds. You need a backup of your funds. So if you could kindly tell us, uh, you know, the fundamental points which a person needs to think about before they actually start a business, please. Thank you very much. Setting up a business is very easy and it could be very, very difficult. Mm -hmm. The first thing, if you want to set a business up, mm -hmm. first, you need to know about that business, what you're doing in and out of that business. You cannot be a stranger of your business. You need to know it back to back. So that when you start, then that will be very, very easy for you. Number two, you need to have enough fund, cash, to back it up. Business without enough fund is like car without petrol. You need enough cash to set a business up. Thirdly, you need a very good location. Location is the key success of your business. Because people buy what they say. You need to have a very good location where you can put your product. People will see it, display it nicely. People find it, see you, and they come to you. That's very, very, very important. But the most important thing, you yourself, you need to know about what kind of business you are doing. Know it back to back. That will make journey very, very easy for you. Thank you. Thank you. Any other thing that you might like to add? Uh, doing a business is very good. Uh, but not everybody will do it successfully but if you do something you are not succeed or you didn't get it right don't stay give up you learn from mistake you far far better off than somebody that never tried it before you learn from your mistake that will help you to progress you can do business, it's like doing business is not 100% that yet yeah, you'll, be, you'll be a winner. But at the same time, don't give up. Keep doing it. You will get there. That's it. A backup, it could be any, it could be from any one of them. If you have a very good credit record, it could be from yeah. your bank. Yeah. If you have a very wealthy family it could yeah. be from the family support or your business need is enough backup fund because when you come into the high street or public area that you want to start your business you are unknown to anybody mm. get in the shop putting your name on the front of your shop 
you are expressing yourself this is me this is how i look like mm-hmm. you want to open your doors to people to come to you you need enough money to bring the very good product mm-hmm. to them mm-hmm. because what keep customer coming back to you is the quality of your product yeah you don't want to have them just only once one time customer you want them to be your every time customer repeat yeah that means you need to get be there to deliver a very good product for them thank you you just need to have a very good supplier yeah because you can't do it as a oh just only you your role is to be in the shop you need to find people that bring the products to the country yeah that is part of your job okay. find a good product and good supplier that's it can you probably just like i don't know mention one supplier uh to be honest with you it depends on the area of the business that individual want to grow okay as everything you want to do in business i always have a supplier in the country you don't need to go to abroad everything mm. is here if you have mm. enough money then you can go to abroad but there yeah. is plenty of mm. supplier in the yeah. country already that does the same thing you won't have unless you want to do it in another high level okay but if it's just on a small scale level yeah you don't need to go to abroad probably that's an encouragement for young people who are yeah. interested in business yeah. Yeah. you know yeah. keep it going don't give up that's it and don't probably with support from family. make fun of it yeah have fun on it create time for yourself enjoying it and love what you're doing if you love it you don't give up easily that's important yeah. love yeah. what you are yeah. doing yeah you that's don't give important. up easily if you love it yeah and you will see the reward as well yeah if you do it successfully and the end of the day you see the reward the okay. reward is huge I've had even people that do work experience also kids yeah. Yeah. Are coming out of secondary school here they yeah. spend yeah. weeks here to do work experience oh, oh that's In secondary good. school they come spend two three weeks here for work experience it's no problem oh, yeah thank you very much that's all right. you I are, appreciate huh? yes. your time yeah. thank you yeah. The, something we didn't mention it the rent is so expensive here in london when you have a shop make sure to make use of the space space is important space is money make good use thank you very much